Thursday, March 1st, 2018. I'm ready to get a lot of stuff done today. I want to get the workout in later. I want to write another article for Just Go Grind. I would like to do some more reading. I just bought like four different books. I think it was Principles, Ray Dalio, um, Tim Ferriss's uh, newest book, Not Total Titans, but Tribe of Mentors, uh, Gary Vaynerchuk's book, Crushing It, and then The uh, New Rules of Work by the two founders of The Muse. So I would like to get all those books read at some point. It's just never enough time. I'll do that later. Today's a big day of work. I'm working on lots of things, trying to just go grind. Again, this is about careers. It's about life in general. Like how do you actually find what you're supposed to be doing, what you wanna do? Because we spend so many hours working, it'd be a shame to be working in a job you hate. And I will fight that at all costs and help people out however I can. I think I have some perspective. Um, and I want to share it with you. So I hope you enjoy. Okay, sleep as an entrepreneur. This is difficult and I haven't figured it out yet. Um, from what I've, what I've learned, how I've gone about this is, you know, if I get one or two nights of less sleep, let's just call it like five, six hours of sleep, I do make a conscious effort to get more the next couple nights and balance it out. It's never actually perfect. Um, it is a constant struggle. There are so many things on your mind. I mean, literally every single night I go to bed, I debate what time to set my alarm. Now, in the past, I have done like, oh, get up at 4 a.m. and that's just what you have to do. You manage your time around that. That works in some ways, but in other ways, it's I, what I normally do is how many hours of sleep I'm gonna get. And that dictates my alarm. That's why people are like, oh, do you stay, you know, do you stay out late? Like, do you get up early every day? Like, it really depends on how I feel, but then also how many hours of sleep I'm going to get. So if I can get to bed by 8 o'clock, yes, 8 o'clock, then yeah, I can get up at 3 and feel okay because I have 7 hours of sleep. I also go to bed at 9 sometimes, though, and still get like 6 hours of sleep getting up at 3 a.m. Yes, 3 a.m., but it depends. On weekends, if I happen to have friends in town, or right now I live in Las Vegas, people visit, you go out and have a great time, that's awesome. Um, my sleep will adjust accordingly, but it's important. You can't deny the fact that you need sleep. It's important. It's something you're gonna struggle with if you're an entrepreneur, if you have a side hustle, you're gonna struggle with this. There is no perfect plan. I wish there was. If there was, I would try to do it. You have to go on feel and how you really, day to day, how you feel, how much sleep you need, energy-wise, how you're handling different things, but you'll figure it out just like I have to, <laughs> you'll figure it out, but make it a priority. It is still important. You have to play a long game in terms of thinking, you're thinking about your whole life here, not just business and careers, and it can be exciting to work on things, but it's really your whole life, your whole entire life, and sleep is gonna be important. There are, I've read an article before about what happens when you don't get enough sleep, and it's not pretty, so make sure you get enough sleep. Hey, this is Justin.